altın madalya hangi ülkenin olacak? Rusya'nın mı Çin'in mi? Herhalde iki sporcumuz izlememiz mümkün de aslında. Evet, çok talihsiz bir şekilde izleyiciler bizi seyrettik. Son saniyede veya altın buluşta gelen puanlar meclisinde maçlarını kaybettiler. I should probably definitely like to do that as a counter. The athletes checking off the front leg should actually come round it and try and go over the top. And that's it for the face. They should change tactics as a counter to the body. There's some encouragement to fight, but they seem to be quite active, in my opinion. So, Wazan needs to just get the dimension a little bit more, get the distance right. Possibly vary a technique a little bit more. Exchange of legs from both of them there. It's a risk when you move in like that. Şimdi de bizi temsil edecek. Ama bir sporcumuz tekrar sormuş olup kapsam dışında mı kalıyor spor edecek? Altın sporcumuz yoksa Russia Cobra go high. Zang needs to change her attack technique. Goes to the back kick, so she does that. She changes the attack technique, goes to the back kick. Doesn't work for her, but... It's the start of uh, creating more opportunities. Russia Cobra then steps up, comes off the back leg. He gets a point, so... Tactically, very strong play from the Russian team. Allah's warning there. I'm not quite sure what Polish is about the match. Katılmakı kazandı ve yine Allah korusun bir sakatlık yaşadı. O zaman İrem Yaman ilk altı içinde yer alıyorsa yerine gidebilecek. Bunun kutu da değil. Bunun kutunun içerisinde olabilir. Bunun içerisinde olabilir. And push through off the front leg with different techniques. So rather than side check and kick, trying to use kick off the front leg with a front leg push kick to the body and score with it, trying to attack and push. So she has adapted to the game like we thought she would have to do. She's still got four points to make up though. 
Bryce and Cobra can play with that same tactic, so that front leg check away with the occasional headshot. Moments of this second round, Bryce and Cobra won't try too much now. She will check away from the front leg. Zen doing well, she's going high. So five points two. Zen did well there to try and change and adapt the game so that she was looking for different scoring opportunities. And Bryce Cobra has really got to stay focused in this last round because Zhang has got that speed and movement. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah. really well and check on the way in. And then with the axe, he's looking for the high shot. She hasn't scored with the high shot, but the threat of it is enough to deter your opponent from moving in certain ways. So, Bryce Cobra probably stick with the same tactic. But Sang from China is really going to have to change the game. And she did try to do that in the other second round. She was trying different techniques, and she did get pretty close. So if she can get through, if Wazan can get through, then it could change the game around in one go. Third round. It looked like it was a good defense by China from, uh, from my angle. But the Russian coach thought that it was sufficient enough to score. So we're seeing that tactic where Bryce Nikov is doing a side check, he got the front leg and picked away to score scoring the points. We've always that threat of the headshot. There she got through with it. It looked to me like Zhang covered it, but we'll see what the judges say. It's rejected, as we thought, it was good defence by the Chinese athlete. She's probably won't be too big about it, she's still leading by three points. So the tactic this is doing that foot check, goes into the head check again, it's going so well for it. She's going to put underneath there, but it's score. She's got a minute now to adapt. Try some different techniques out. First final of the Samsung Grand Prix here in Turkey. Anastasia yeah. Panikova, ranked number two in the world, is now the Grand Prix champion. She's our first gold medalist of the day. It was a very, very strong performance, both tactically and physically. She's made 